Hello friends and welcome back to a brand new episode of Crusader Kings 3 and in the last episode we were targeting to overthrow our ruler but we hit a roadblock our ruler kind of passed away and we were we got a new ruler which was our son and now they had to do a bit of power struggle and then we also got attacked by our neighbor so if we didn't if you didn't see that episode i encourage you to go back and look at that because that had uh, quite a bit of exciting stuff uh, but without further further ado let's jump straight ahead into the next one so again the goal for this one remains same uh, is which is to overthrow our ruler somehow and i I have no idea whether we'll be able to do that. This episode, they are also very old, so they are likely to pass away. And in that case, we are going to have a better chance because this dude is going to be having low control and uh, low whatever. So, so they will have some trouble in in terms of getting ahead, uh, like getting a firm. Firm hold on the on the empire, so we should be able to take that in this episode. At least that's what the goal is. So without further ado, let's get started. So our first order of business is to get the meritocracy perk from this wealth focus. Uh, so sorry, from the stewardship focus. And as soon as we pick this up, and the cooldown is over. So if we are midway picking up another one, we'll just pick one more, like golden obligations. That's not bad. This can help. But apart from that, we'll just jump back straight into this one, and we will be picking this up because this does help a lot in terms of growth when you have when you start wielding significant power, and in terms of uh, the plenary assemblies or whatever. so we are actually doing well we are we are on our way to research this and it should be done pretty soon 10 years is not a long time for research and once that is done we should be able to start increasing our uh, uh our crown authority and start revoking type titles and such where wherever required So those are a few other things we will be taking care of, and then in terms of succession, we do want to be passing certain laws, and we want to be passing moving towards high partition, maybe, and we do want to reach absolute crown authority because our heir is not very good to be honest. and we'll have to replace them somehow because they are like to be honest they are really not good and we don't want them to be our heir because they are like rowdy is good but then this hideous is really bad and it's going to impact it's really going to impact our future generation so it's another thing to keep in mind we'll probably send them off to fight battles and such things that they probably cannot win maybe yeah let's see and next thing we want to do is we want to increase control in our capital obviously because it was taken last episode and now we can mm, yeah what are they good at they are they should be good at my uh, intrigue okay martial yeah man let's let's give them martial maybe yeah so this is the one who will be taking care of them and then the other one is this and he is hmm we enter an alliance with them kind of army they have they have like very little army to be honest but yeah we'll we'll take whatever we can get maybe 
Hmm, can we revoke the title on such? Revoke title. Yeah. Yeah, we will probably revoking revoking the titles and such. So will not enter on the lands unless it's absolutely necessary. And we are not planning to enter wars right now. And these vessels. Let's see if we have any good vessels. They are good, but not good enough for our council. And same is the story with them. So we leave them out. Declaring wars. This is a war I do not want to fight right now. Like even though I can win. Uh, for what? Like yeah, we can. No, we, we don't want to fight that war right now. Um, what is the claim that we have here? What is this? Yeah, no, that's okay. I don't want to be fighting those wars right now. Um, yeah, Jenny is the one we really want to take. Yeah. Right, so the only issue that we have right now is our gold will not be improving uh, fast enough. That's going to be a problem, but we'll deal with that. Okay. Alright, so we got an option to pick uh, Dynasty Legacy. So let's see which one we want to pick. Fertility. Match acceptance. Yeah, this is good. Like we can get good characters and improve our character overall. I guess recruitment cost is lower, which is nice. Yeah, this this I really like. Reputation. Hmm. Yeah, this this is okay. I'm really nice tree to go down mostly fair hunt and feast cost is reduced now we do want to go to hunt and do the feast every few years so this is definitely worth having um, yeah all these are like really nice juicy hmm do we want to go that route though? Not right now. What else do we want? I want this one. <clears throat> yeah, this is something I need to have. Maybe, but I'll, I'll, I'll just pick this one because of the popular opinion and the Saving the money because in the early stages of the game, I think money is the most important thing. Later on, as we progress and it becomes more accessible, we can focus on other things. Uh, okay. So they are giving me Chancellor. I accept. Why not? And we will be. So we generate more prestige which is awesome fellow vessel opinion is increased and then yeah yeah this is awesome so once we switch to diplo it's it's really going to be we're already going to be killing it so yeah yeah we'll, we'll switch over to this as soon as we pick that one up pick the other trade up which is being able to no sorry I will not but we do need to throw a party of some kind yeah we will lose stress 
we had a lot of stress even though we lost a bit of money it's okay now we will not send them oh 500 stewardship experience that's awesome yeah we don't want control growth like we can it's always nice mm. yeah but we'll we'll take this because of the stewardship experience and we simply got the perk right yeah let's pick this one because we want to be able to start the claim immediately as soon as possible then we'll go for the golden applications and now let's see what's oh man this is like the best chance possible right and yeah let's let's go for it no better time to do it than now hmm let's see they are 34 demand conversion will accept alright so now they Did he die? It is a mystery. Oh, does she hold she hold this? And she has Yeah, uh, she has a lot of claims. I uh, can demand conversion one two. Maybe I can sway them, but since we have a situation of our own which is more pressing to take care of we want to be running this scheme to be producing more kids if possible if it doesn't happen we'll have to hmm okay that's sad Let's see if we can invite anyone. Uh, right, if we bribe, if we bribe, they will accept. And there's like long enough time. We'll see. fortunate <laughs> to have happened <clears throat> yeah so she's not is generous, diligent, patient, fortune builder. Uh, she is rational and good in mind. Beautiful. Is she beautiful? Uh, oh no. Let's go with this one. Uh, 
one plus twenty percent. We don't need to reduce the stress now. The stress level is pretty high. We want to be able to lose some of it, so we'll be holding the party. And then uh, that's that's the reason I that like took 30 off directly liquid off from that party cost. Got some money. That's nice. We are able to change focus now. So as soon as we pick another perk, it will be. Mm. Yeah, we'll probably go with taxman. Maybe. Or, hmm, or profiteer this one. Uh, I think I'll use this one because it's it's quite good to be honest to be able to like, do it regularly. It gives a lot of money as well. The offset subjects is okay. That's the cost to pay.
okay so my leech's opinion is false claimant <laughs> yeah finally we got that claim that we were waiting for and now we will be starting a claimant faction and then we will be picking ourselves up for this oh we are strong can we have members join us hmm. oh we got a member and Yeah, it's, it's really powerful to have more people join. It's like takes away, takes away the, yeah, let's see, can we sway them to join? We're getting there so now we do have really nice power as soon as we are able to we'll send them the ultimatum victory strength We should accept ideally, we'll see. We also have a bit of money saved up for maybe if we wanted to do like a mercenary. Uh, no, this. Uh, this is some like one mercenary we can pick up if we're really desperate. Hmm. Yeah. Let's see what's the situation with our leech. They have a couple of cruises. They have 1600. Yeah, I don't think they have a chance. So let's see if we can cross the mounts. Can we add someone? Anyone? No, that's fine, we can trust amounts. Yeah, they don't have gold. Organized service, holding taxes, that's good. Okay, good. Now let's see where do we want to raise our army. Hmm. We want to raise them like here maybe. Yeah, let's raise them here. Try and attack as quickly as possible. They have Here, ally army. Yeah, uh, let's see. Let's pick them, maybe. Yeah, let them run. left and they should be able to run Yeah, this is like 
terrible. <laughs> Okay, stewardship work available. Let's take it then. It is my domain. Unlock and we will switch over to Prestige. Do I want prestige? I don't need prestige right now. Fertility. That's no, okay. We take foreign affairs. Yeah, we, we are in a good position. I mean, they are an ally army that lost. It's okay. Another ally army will be losing. We just want the capital. Can we get that? Okay, good. So we got them. Now it's time to attack them. Time for us to win this war. Okay, cool. So now we are going to be. This um, should be winning this pretty soon. Let's see why it's 93. Okay. So maybe we will just. Cold and I got support and I won the war. All in all, it's a pretty good deal. It's enforced demands. So be it. Okay, I got the that's fine. Yeah, about well, the domain limit, that's also fine. We will figure something out. Well, alright friends, so we have won this war as well and in the next episode we'll be taking care of this one but honestly I don't expect them to be able to win this. Yeah, what do they want? We'll, we'll see. We'll figure it out. We have, we do have a lot of uh, money in our kitty so if we really wanted to we could uh, we could simply be we could simply go ahead and hire mercenaries and take care of this war as well and that's probably what we are going to do anyways so next time we will be looking at stabilizing redistributing some of the stuff and we are going to be having fun All right, friends, it was really fun bringing this episode to you. And if you enjoyed this as well, then please don't forget to like and subscribe. As you can see, that's a new channel and every bit of support helps a lot. Um, 
please let me know what you think about the content and if you like it i'll continue to make more of it have a nice one bye bye